What's up YouTube fam and how's it going? So I'm gonna start this video off with showing you how I looked just five months ago. I was pretty much 600 pounds, unhappy, and just probably close to death. What is up guys? It has been a month and I have not posted. You guys are probably like, yo Hefe, what the hell's wrong? You said 2020 is gonna be different. Yeah, I know, but the end of 2019, I was going through a lot from the surgery. I had a lot to learn uh, from not being hungry, learning what to eat and learning to tell myself to eat. And then obviously, you know, just going through healing of the surgery, stuff like that. Uh, it was just a lot going on and I don't know if I didn't want to post, I didn't want to post because there's a lot going on, a lot going in my head. But then again, I want to stay positive and I want to just sit down and really like relearn myself and re relearn my body because that's what it is, a whole new stomach. And your boy has lost 176 pounds, as you could see. And that is why I stood away from you guys for a month. I wanted to make a big transition, a big change, a noticeable change. And I, I hopefully you guys can see because I feel it. I see it, my scale sees it, my doctor see it, my family see it, my clothes see it. As you see, I'm not just wearing a black shirt. I actually got, you know, some lettering on it. But the last month has been a very, very long process, a great process of me relearning my body and staying motivated and just preparing myself for a new life. And it's been amazing. It's probably the best thing I've ever done. And I'm still gonna continue guys, I'm still gonna continue to bring you guys on with my journey. All right, now I'm about to head over to the gym, West Coast Athletics. You already know they're a big part of this whole weight loss. After the surgery, I'm not technically I'm not supposed to work out for like three to four to five months. It's barely two months, and I'm gonna go back. I'm gonna take it light, but I'm so excited just to get back in the gym and to just be moving. I've been doing about six to seven thousand steps a day, still eating healthy, green drinks, vegetables, chicken, all that good stuff. I'm on normal food now, but I really, really want to get back in the gym. And um, yes, I'm happy to be back on YouTube. If you guys don't know yet, I'm just gonna tell you guys. Your boy is kind of TikTok famous. Let's so go ahead and follow me on TikTok, Heavy and Modified. Follow me on Instagram, Heavy and Modified. Like and subscribe to the YouTube if you're not subscribed yet. Your boy was almost 600 pounds. I've never really showed full body because a low, kind of, kind of insecure. I really don't have insecurities, but I really noticed now from having the YouTube for almost three years, you guys see me lose weight. And well, you guys see me small, and then you guys see me just become like a fucking baby well. And now I'm showing full body because I'm more than happy. I still have, I'm more than happy with how I look, and it, it's a blessing. So, anyone out there that's looking to start a weight loss journey and just wants to drop some weight, wants to gain weight, put muscle, lose muscle, whatever it is, uh, just do it, just start it, and you know, just move for a bit healthier life. Uh, don't want to get too cheesy with it, but I just want to say thank you guys so much for all the support. You guys have been asking for updates, videos. Uh, I just wanted to wait, 100%. I wanted to wait so I could show you, you know, like, I lost like a half a half a. You know what I mean? I lost like two Christians. Thank you, Christian, premium Christian buttons behind the camera right now filming this. But right now, let's get over to the gym. We'll do some workouts, and uh, I'm excited to be back, guys. If you guys are excited, please comment and like because it motivates me to keep making videos. All right, guys, right now I'm on my way to the gym. I just want to hop on and just, you know, just talk. This is probably going to be all talking, a little bit of me working out. Um, I just want... I just definitely just want to say thank you to all the support and uh, thank you to all the comments. Uh, again, I know I talked about it earlier. Sometimes when I start a video, I'm just super hyped up. There's so much I want to say and there's so much I forget. But I've gotten countless DMs from a lot of you people from YouTube, um, some that follow me on Instagram also that uh, say that I'm, I motivate them. And I think it's dope and I, I think it's, uh, it's an honor to be able to motivate someone. Um, I'm not going to be trying to become a uh, you know a physique model or bodybuilder or anything like that i am doing this for the simple fact that i want to be healthy and i want to be around to be making content for you guys being there for my family and, and everyone you know um this is probably the best life decision that i've ever made uh because it was something that needed to be done because let's be realistic at the weight that i was going 
uh, I was probably going to be dead soon, and no one wants to hear that. No one wants to think about that, but that is just on bottom line truth. And if you're out there and you are overweight or you want, like, you know, whatever it is and you just want to talk, feel free to hit me up on Instagram. Uh, like I said, I'm no health guru. I'm still fat myself. But this is something that I'm doing for myself. And I've you seen before you seen before the surgery, I lost 96 pounds, uh, basically 100 pounds before I went into surgery. And I've lost another 70 some pounds since then. It's been a, um, a little over a month. Um, I'm just thankful. I'm really just thankful. It feels good to have this camera up and to be able to be talking to you guys and to show a difference. And I'm excited. I'm really, really excited to see how you guys are like, damn, you really lost a lot of weight or damn, you look the same. Whatever it is, I, you know what I mean? It just, it feels really good to, to have this camera up and to be creating content again. Now, I know you guys are gonna be wondering about my car. So let me tell you, let me, damn, my arm's getting heavy. Um, so let me go and talk about my car real quick. So I was going to sell my car. 100% during this month I was gonna get rid of it uh, but I love it too much I've done so much work to it uh, I've learned so much with it I just can't get rid of it Daniel for premium talked me out of it and it didn't really didn't take a lot of talking out of it because I love my car I'm not financially struggling um, so I just wanted to keep it so the car still gonna be getting worked on uh, there's gonna be I keep on saying oh, a lot this is I guess what happens when you start vlogging again after you haven't vlogged for so long I am gonna be ordering some parts. So the next thing I wanna do to my car is for sure get it wrapped. So I'm going to plan a date. So I did have a date earlier with Prima before, and if you guys know, my grandpa got sick, so I had a lag on that, but we're gonna wrap it again. Daniel talked to me, he's like, yo, let's wrap the car, and let's powder coat the rims, let's give it a new look. So that's coming up, and I am ordering a nitrous kit for the car. So those are the two things I'm gonna be doing, and I've been driving a lot more. I just generally, I think, after I wanted to sell the car, I fell more in love with the car. So the car is not going anywhere, the car is here to stay, and when the time comes to get rid of it, I actually, I don't think there's ever a good time to get rid of it. I'm the, the, I'm keeping the car. But moving on to the weight loss thing, I've been noticing that the weight loss right now has been the biggest niche. You know, going from almost 600 pounds to right now 430 something, 20 something. Um, I, I stopped looking at the scale. I'm just more focusing on like, how my clothes fit and how my face is looking and uh, uh, just a lot of things of how how I see myself losing weight. So that's a pretty big thing for me. And you know, doing the car content is my passion. I love cars to death. But I, my main thing is why I got on YouTube is because I like to entertain people, whether it be making people laugh, making people happy, making people sad, I guess, when they have bad days, whatever it is. But I like creating content, not only for myself, for other companies, if you guys know I work, I do all the content for premium auto styling and a couple other companies like CCNC. So I, it, it's just a blessing. And you know, for me to have one more niche under my belt where I can help someone out, lose five pounds, 10 pounds, or just motivate them to just get up off the couch, um, that's something that is amazing. And I'm prideful on that, that people hit me up and ask me questions because man, I, I don't know. I was just looking back and I was just really so unhappy a couple months ago. And I'm not saying about my looks because I've always had confidence, but my weight was holding me back from being the person that I really wanted to be. And now with it coming off and me feeling the way I feel, which I'm still a little tired from the surgery, that just kind of happens. It goes away in about two or three months. Uh, but I just feel a million times better. And I just know that this is going to just even better my career in filming, better my career in business. And it's all around just gonna be good. I, I just wanna get on here and say that. If, I really hope that moving forward, these videos that I create, whether they be for cars or weight related, I really hope they motivate you to do something, start a business, to lose weight, to get a better job, to quit a job that you don't get treated right, whatever it is, I really hope they motivate you to do that. And I hope when you guys watch my channel, you guys learn something from it. That's my goal 2020. For every single piece of content I put out, someone gains something from it. All right, you guys, so I'm just getting to the gym. It's crazy. So let me tell you what I've been going through for this last, like, it's like we'll say a month and two weeks since my surgery. It's been a complete life change. It's been the best thing I've ever done. I feel healthier. I look healthier. I hope you guys notice. I'm so sorry that I made you guys wait a month and two weeks for me to post a video. But man, I was looking at the old videos that you see in the beginning of this video. I just did not look good. I was not healthy. I was not happy. But anyways, let's get in the gym.
All right, so some of the workouts I've been doing since my surgery has been jujitsu, uh, kickboxing, and obviously MMA. Uh, I haven't announced, I've announced this on my TikTok, like I said earlier, your boy did go TikTok famous. I'm at like 117,000 followers on TikTok. It's freaking nuts. But anyways, I know there's music playing in the background. Uh, I do want to fight at the end of the year or beginning of next year. My boy Wadwa, the, the owner of the, Wadwa, the, my boy Wadwa, the owner of the gym, I told him I want to fight. That's a goal I'm setting. I'm planning the seat now. I've told TikTok, I'm telling you, and then obviously whoever else I need to tell in order to keep me motivated and to keep me going to make sure I reach my goal.